basketball fans across the world. The All-Star Game. We'll have the greatest athletes in the world playing the greatest game in the world. We're happy to bring it to you right here on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. From the sideline, our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. Now a look at the West All-Stars starting lineup. We've got Durant, DeMarcus Cousins out there, Kawhi Leonard. Then it's Curry, and it's Westbrook in at the one spot. And fans and celebrities alike have descended on this town for All-Star Week. There's been a bunch of fun events going on all over the place. And, Greg, it's like that every year. I mean, no matter what city is hosting, it becomes a... Ooh. Ooh. That's how you attack. Wow. Oh, man. My, my, my. Oh, now, that's an all-star dunk. That's why he's here. That Kia slam cam replay really gave you a good look at the action. It's stolen by Curry. And here they come. The shot from the low post is good. In the first half of his season, boy, how special has it been. He has been on a rampage. Yeah, and he's got tremendous talent. And when he's fully healthy and engaged, I mean, he's really impossible to stop. That's what we've been seeing this year from him. No good from Irving. And for me, this is always one of the best weeks of the year. So much fun for everyone involved. Fans, players, coaches. What a blast. Yeah, the NBA knows how to throw a party in celebrating its game. There's no doubt about that. And All-Star Week is one great show after another. Outside wall. Here's LeBron. And it's good. Off through contact. Gets the shot. He'll go to the free throw line. Offensively, he can be the engine that drives them at any given time. And he's got his first chance at the line here. One shot. And the free throw, no good. West All-Stars off to a quick start here. It's a five-point game, and Westbrook throws it down. They're doing a lot of spectating there on D. But hey, it's the All-Star game. A little over a minute 30 into this first quarter. And Wall kicks to James. Back to Wall. And Wall with the slam. And that's some inspiration. Steals, blocks, and a big dunk. Those are ways that you can really change the momentum in a game. Well, they got to chip away at that deficit, and no doubt that'll help. And that's what he's out there for, guys. I mean, he is an electrifying player, no doubt. George passes to LeBron. It's not going to go for him. Great D that time from Durant. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Well, Kevin, Steve Kerr gave me a few minutes to catch up with him, and he's completely unconcerned with the game's outcome. He said, I'm really worried about only two things, that everyone gets enough time on the floor and that nobody gets hurt. Sounds right to me, Kevin. Back to you. Thank you, David. And you know what? When Paul George sees an open teammate, he doesn't hesitate. I mean, he quickly gets the ball out of his hands. It doesn't stick with him. Oh, oh inflicting some punishment with the two-hand flush. Ah, they're going for the throat. Now's the time to do it. Keep attacking that rim. Oh, and a nice job of turning that miss into two points on the tip end. Hustle points, I believe they call them. Hustle points right there. And great instincts, too, guys, anticipating where the miss was going. Curry shot is off. And Wall kicks to Anthony. That's good. And so Wall with the assist. And it looks like he might just be on his A game today, Clark. Well, you know, it's still early, partner, but that's what we're seeing so far. And we know what he can do on one of his better days. He's hard to handle. And it's Westbrook missing. He's with the ball. They trail by three. George dishes to LeBron. Irving with a clean look. Can't tie it up as that one's no good. First quarter of play and uh, just over three and a half minutes in. Westbrook with a wide open look. Another miss by Westbrook. The three from George. Unable to get that one. The West All-Stars will go the other way with it. Kicks to Leonard. They find Jay on the way. And good that time. Leonard's got six. And here are the East All-Stars now. Timeout. It's a five-point game. 
And the East All-Stars right. decide to take their first time out here. for the East. And you know, the fan voting is what determines the starters in the All-Star game. Then the coaches will decide on the reserves. But either way, whether you're picked by the fans or the coaches, earning the title NBA All-Star, that's an honor none of these players will ever forget. Lowry against Harden on the strike. Lowry can't get it to go. And it's the West All-Stars ball. Leading by five. Lillard from outside. And it's rebounded by Bosch. Well, Greg, one thing we know for sure, you know that every player who earned a spot on this roster is going to see his share of action spreading the minutes evenly. As you've always talked about, it's always a top priority for these All-Star game coaches. And you're so right, Kevin. I mean, for all the hard work these players put in to get here, I mean, each one deserves a chance, if you will, to share the spotlight. It's one of the great things about the All-Star game. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for the West All-Stars. It looks like they're ready to run, fellas. I mean, they haven't hesitated at all to get out on the break so far. And also, defensively, they've been able to cause some turnovers tonight. And, and that also builds confidence and gives you momentum. And he ends up missing both free throws. One twenty two left in the first quarter. Here's Griffin and the slam by Blake Griffin. Great job to hit his teammate on that move Kevin. And here are the East All-Stars now. They trail by seven. Lowry kicks to DeRozan. That falls nice feed that time from Kyle Lowry. Yeah, teammate to teammate on the assist that time. Well the communication between them that's what we see every game during the regular season and it's on display here in the All-Star week as well. A nice shot by Griffin. Well, let's say the defense being played here tonight might be a, a bit on the soft side for, from both teams. Well, I know you're not surprised, are you? I mean, fast and loose is the way this game should be played. Bosch, the screen. Lowry kicks to DeRozan. To the inside. Here's Drummond, and lots of contact there. Missing the shot, he'll shoot two. It's going to be on DeAndre Jordan. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clearly. No question about it, Greg. I mean, a ton of contact and a good call by the officials. Shooting two. That one is off. And he's good on the second. 32 seconds left to play in the first quarter. And Lillard kicks to Harden. Hayward goes in. It's so about it's a Kumbo. And they're on the break. And there's Lowry. That's good on the assist by Antetokounmpo. That giant wingspan of Antetokounmpo. Man, wreaking havoc on opposing players. And really, 
mucking up passing lanes too, man. He can be everywhere with that ferocious motor and those long arms. Here's Harden. From out on the wing, he knocks it down. Harden's got his first points of the game. A free-flowing first quarter. Great scoring through one. It's the West All-Stars. They're up by six. After this break, we'll be back with the start of the second quarter on 2K Sports. Unfolding one quarter of basketball already played, and welcome back everyone to this year's coverage of the NBA All Star Game. And guys, we've already seen some unbelievable action here tonight, and there will be plenty more to come. We know that All Star action never disappoints. Officials not giving their whistles much of a workout here tonight. Very few fouls being called. And most of that, Greg, is because they're not playing full force defense. I mean, you're never going to see as much contact around the bucket in this game as you would ordinarily. DeRozan out there with Chris Bosch. Then there's Andre Drummond. Then there's Lowry. And it's Wade in at the two guard position. So that's who the East All-Stars start the second with. Hayward kicks to Griffin. Andre Drummond grabs the miss. Boy, I tell you what, guys, he's an extremely strong finisher. I'm surprised he wasn't able to power that through the defense. And if the shot's not there, you've got to understand that move the basketball. Yeah, exactly, and I'm not quite sure what his mindset or what he was thinking there. I mean, it was just a terrible shot. Here's DeRozan. And that one hits back iron. Harden with it. Wade picks him up. He couldn't stay in bounds, and that's going to be a turnover. A temporary lapse of focus from him on that turnover. It's embarrassing, but on occasion it does happen. And the East All-Stars with some changes. Paul George, he's checked in for Bosch. James comes in for DeMar DeRozan. And Reggie Jackson subbed in for Kyle Lowry. DeMarcus Cousins, he's checked in for the West. Durant comes in for Gordon Hayward. George has gone one of three from the field here. And there's Davis. That's good on the assist by Paul. Davis has got the opening basket here in the second quarter for the West All-Stars. Jackson passes to Drummond. Wade dishes to George. The shot, no good. Great tee that time from Davis. And here's the West with the ball. They haven't allowed any points in the second quarter. And on an open look like that, he's very gifted at making the weak coverage pay. And George, here we go. Kicks it out to James. Drummond sets the screen for LeBron. To the middle. It's tipped. Here's Paul. Quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Nailed from three-point land. And good passing, setting up a lot of these buckets right now, Kevin. That's been the key. Time-dropping delights is what I call it. I, yeah, that is a nice pass. I will give you that one. Yeah, he was on the money, that's no doubt.
Carmelo Anthony. He's checked in for Andre Trump. Curry's checked in for the West. <laughs> Quarter number two. We're about two minutes in. Wade outside. Back to LeBron. Pass to Anthony. Yes, and it's LeBron picking up the assist. And that's now six points for Carmelo Anthony. And the West All-Stars have possession. Ball outside. There's a good screen. There's the feed to Curry. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. Yeah, way to play in attack mode and get to the line. And, you know, the defense gets their money's worth on that foul. Stopping the layup and not giving up the and one. And he's got his first free throw of the game. First one falls for him. And some changes here for the East. Kyrie Irving's checked in for Wade. And John Walls subbed in for Reggie Jackson. The West All-Star is also changing it up. Leonard, he's checked in for Durant. And Russell Westbrook is subbed in for Paul. And both free throws good for Curry. And here in the second quarter of action with a hair under two and a half minutes played so far. James kicks the wall. On its way from Irving for two. Cousins pulls it in. Cousins has got his third rebound on the night. Outside Westbrook, he dishes it to Davis. Good on the 13-footer. Davis has got four points in the quarter. And he could be the guy to put this game out of reach. Yeah, that's a great call by you, Greg. You're right on top of it. He's a player that knows exactly how to seek out that jump. And, and just a step ahead of the D in that possession there, making the pass. Nice assist. Screen by Cousins. Leonard kicks to Cousins. 20 feet out. It's hauled in by the East All-Stars. George has got four rebounds now tonight. To the inside, Anthony. Good. Boy, I like seeing George Passes serve two. up his teammates. He's an exceptional passer who can pick one. apart most defense. And the East All-Stars making a change here. Ante DeCubos checked in. The West All-Stars also with a sub. Jordan's checked in. That's good from Anthony. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Curry kicks to Leonard. Curry passes to Davis. This is his first free throw of the game. First free throw is good. And so Anthony Davis nails both of them. As we've gotten closer to halftime, their style has become more and more physical. Boy, it certainly appears to be the case, Greg. I mean, they've spent a lot of time at the foul line this quarter, and that's the result of attacking the rim and being physical. And here in the second quarter of action as we approach four minutes played, and here's Westbrook from the arc. East grabs the miss. In the corner, it's James. Fires from deep. Good, and the assist goes to Irving. LeBron's got five now. Yeah, clearly a defensive lapse there. He is automatic from deep if you're going to leave him that wide open. Big time mistake. Curry dishes to Westbrook. From outside, off the mark. Well, you know, they're in the lead, but he's still been frustrated from an offensive standpoint. And that one's good, Irving. 
Yeah, such a crafty move. That's an all-star game special right there, folks. That certainly isn't any regular season move. I agree with that. I mean, you save that kind of move for the big stage of the all-star week. Ball against Westbrook. Leonard, the pass to Davis. Down it goes for his third basket in as many tries. He has such a nice touch for a big man. Yeah, and they've got to figure out a way to get a bigger body on him because if they don't match up his size, then he's going to continue to work him over the rest of the game. Anthony with the screen on Leonard. LeBron kicks to Anthony. Unloads from nine, and Davis pulls it down. 56 seconds left here in the second. Pops it up for Jordan. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley oop attempt there. Inside, here's on to Takumbo. A stupendous finish in traffic. On to Takumbo's got his first two points. Now they've done a great job of getting into the middle of that defense and scoring in the paint. And that's why they're on this run. You get that close to the hoop, and it's a lot easier to make shots. Westbrook can't get it to go. Can't get anything to drop. I mean, the way he's going, it's probably not something he should try and shoot his way out of. <laughs> well, they say you should shoot your way out of it, but his teammates probably have other thoughts in mind. The last thing they want to see him doing is continuing to cast that jumper up. Here's LeBron, five points in the game. Let's the three fly. And so that brings the first half to a close. West All-Stars lead by seven. We've got more NBA basketball coming your way in just a minute. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back, folks. We hope you enjoyed the first half of the All-Star game. Ernie Johnson still here with Shaq and Kenny the Jet, as you might have guessed. The Western Conference showing off its All-Star game chops there in the first half. When the showmanship is ramped up to its highest level, that suits the West just fine. They got a roster that knows how to play the game with flair, and they've been enjoying themselves so far today. Well, when it comes to a shootout, the Wild West is what it's all about. These guys score in bunches. Really hard to match up with. The East has tried to put up a fight, but they don't really have the same level of talent as you've seen in the first half. We know the Western Conference roster is filled with superstars, not just all-stars. But the best of the best in the East aren't going to just go down without a fight. I think the East needs to be a little bit more physical and probably work a little bit harder, and the second half is going to be fun. That, sadly, wraps up the halftime show. No. The third quarter set to begin in just a few. We'll see you right here, though, after the game, so you have that to look forward to. Kenny had so much more to say. And we return to the NBA All-Star Game. One half is in the books, and the second half about to begin. Yeah, and I'm looking for the temperature to start to rise here a little bit in this second half. Yeah, I'm exactly with you there. I think we'll see a little less showmanship and a little more intensity from here on out. the East All-Stars with the ball. Seven-point differential. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade for the second half of basketball. On the court for the West All-Stars, Kawhi Leonard is out there with Durant. Then there's Russell Westbrook. Then there's DeMarcus Cousins. And it's Curry in at the shooting guard position. Great way to start to have easy layup against some soft D. Yeah, I think some of the players, Greg, quite honestly, are, are heavy leg. I mean, they don't seem to have been warmed up effectively here to start the second half. Irving with the ball. Guarded now by Durant. A shot's good from Irving. Westbrook with it. Passes it to Cousins. 
puts it up from 17, and that's off the glass and in. Cousins has got four points now in the quarter. Nice piece of work there. Get yourself a little space and pull the trigger. George sets a screen for James. Off the screen. Good on that shot, and with that, the West All-Stars lead is cut down now to just seven on the bucket from George. Pass to Kerr. The three. Trains the three-pointer. Curry's got seven. Up and in on every one of their first three Start. shots to start the second half. And the East All-Stars call time here. with some changes. Andre Drummond's checked in for Anthony. DeRozan comes in for James. And it's Kyle Lowry in for John Wall. The West also making some changes. James Harden comes in for Curry. And Lillard subbed in for Russell Westbrook. A shot by Lowry. Wide open. No good from outside. Lowry's gone. One of three shooting so far. Down low. Here's Cousins. That's good. And it's Leonard with the assist. And it's a 12-point West All-Star lead. And still perfect in the second half. Four straight makes. Outside Lowry. The wide-open look here for DeRozan. Offline with his three. Boy, but he was close, Kevin, to making the defense pay for lackadaisical coverage there. Yeah, you may not be as lucky next time down if you're the defense. You cannot allow him to get those kinds of looks. Irving for three. It's rebounded by Durant. Durant's got three rebounds now in this one. And you know what? He's just not on his game. No doubt about it. Their deficit isn't totally on him, but he has not been an asset for his team. Three-pointer. Lowry drills the three-pointer. Lowry's got it back down to single digits for the East All-Star. Most any player can make you pay when you leave them that wide open. That's why you have to stay alert on defense. Durant with a wide open look. The putback. It's good on the putback. He played an important role in their offense today, guys. Without him, they may not be in the lead. Lowry kicks to DeRozan. Inside. George, no good. Boy, they were ready for him right there. I mean, totally collapsed the defense on it. Durant dishes to Harden. And he can't bank that one in. Irving with the ball. And it's Harden picking him up. Here's Drummond. Ball's not loose. And, and you know what? Defensively, both teams have picked it up as we've gotten a little deeper into this game. A little more competitive fire and intensity being shown out there now. Irving from long range. The West All-Stars pull it in. Durant's got four rebounds in this game. Unfortunately, that's been the result for him over and over, guys. He just gets not find the yes, bottom of the basket. It. Just lazy defense on the glass there. Well, nobody boxed out. Nobody put a body on anybody else. Things like that not only drive the coach crazy, that stuff gets under my skin. And the East with some changes. Chris Bosh has checked in for Drummond. Giannis Antetokounmpo comes in for George. And Dwayne Wade subbed in for Irving. Blake Griffin, he's checked in for the West. Hayward comes in for Kawhi Leonard. Outside DeRozan, back to Lowry. Dishes to Bosch. That falls, nice feed that time from Kyle Lowry. And he's been passive today, but maybe that's what he needs to get him going because for them to be successful, he's got to be a little more selfish. And Hayward gets it to go. You might not think of him as a laser three-point shooter, but that shot was there for him, and he had to take it. 
and the East All-Stars call time here. Yeah, I think he just sees some things that can be improved and wants to get everybody back on the same page. And usually that, to me, is a good use of the timeout. I mean, if there's something that he's noticed that can give his team a lift, um, I think he's got to try to take advantage of that. Bosch passes to Wade. A three ball. Good on that shot. And with that, the West All-Stars lead is cut down to just 12 points on the bucket from Lowry. And here is Durant. Griffin inside. He's up against Bosch. Now here's Hayward. DeRozan defending. Five on the clock. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by DeRozan. Oh, nice play there to get a hand on that pass and tip it out of bounds. Just a whisker away from coming up with the steal there. Catching up on the changes for the East. Anthony comes in for DeMar DeRozan. And it's Jackson in for Kyle Lowry. The West All-Stars also changing it up. Curry's checked in for Harden. And Chris Paul's subbed in for Lillard. And it's Paul missing. I tell you what, folks. I bet he won't miss that shot next time he takes it. Anthony against Griffin. Here's Bosch. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the gentlemen. contact right there. Two. Chris and some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for the West All-Stars. What a tremendous showing from the three-pointer all through this game. They've consistently drilled the mid-range jumper tonight as well, which has forced the D to come out on them. And that one falls for Bosch. And so Bosch nails both of them. And it's been a really good day for him at the line. Some other bigs have well-documented problems on their free throws. He's not one of them. Picked by Griffin. Curry outside. Sinks it. What range from outside. Wow. Curry's got 10. Oh, beautiful looking shot. I mean, when you can hit it from that deep, wow. Here's Honda Takumbo. That's good. And it's Jackson with the assist that time. Oh, Maestro, he is so good at making those lead passes, like conducting an orchestra. Paul kicks to Griffin, and it goes out of bounds. Uh, last touch by Paul. i tell you what, that's just a major unforced error right there, guys. My goodness. John Wall's checked in for the East. They're looking now at a sizable deficit. And there's still time left, so they don't necessarily have to really rush the game. They need to avoid that. I tell you what, what a good thing that he showed up today because without him, this thing would already be over. Shut up, shut up. Al Paul, he hasn't yet put up any points in this one. Here's the screen. It's Durant on the way with one on the clock. No good trying to beat the buzzer. The points coming in bunches as we wrap up the third quarter. It's been a good one. West All-Stars out in front, up nine. Don't go anywhere. The final quarter is coming up next on 2K Sports. We've been having a great time here. We hope you have been, too. The All-Star Game coverage continues. Thanks again for tuning in here to 2K Sports. And, you know, you always look forward to this game, and, and, and this one certainly has lived up to the billing so far. There is not another show in sports quite like the NBA All-Star Game, is there?
and not as many turnovers as, as we often get in this game. So good to see both teams taking care of the ball. Yeah, it really is. I mean, surprisingly, very well controlled for the most part. Sometimes things get a little wild out there, but not so here. Ball out there with Kyrie Irving. Then it's Paul George. Then it's LeBron James. And it's Drummond in its center. So that's the five in the game for the East All-Stars. Griffin dishes to Curry. Wide open, couldn't capitalize. Beyond the arc. He's off on that one. Now the West All-Stars the other way. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Griffin attacking. It's good. Griffin's got the first points up on the board here in the fourth for the West All-Stars. Outside wall. Irving kicks to George. Puts up a three. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Hey, leaving Paul George loose at the three-point line is a big mistake. He's good behind the arc. He actually one of the better three-point shooters in the league. Cousins, the pass to Griffin. That one wide left. Guys, some great passing from him. Yeah, everybody's touching it, and you're starting to see the assist pile up because the rhythm is on display offensively. What a time for him to step up. Big three right there. Yeah, you know what? It appeared to me as though the defense was willing to, to bait him into that shot, and I think if they keep doing that, we might see something special from him down the stretch. That one goes in. Wow, he was just wide open there. That's way too easy. We're just over a minute and a half now into the fourth. Irving can't get it to go. It was rough shooting night tonight, but you can't fault him for the effort. Curry wide open. A three-pointer no good. Boy, from my angle, it looked like it was in the bottom of the net. Looked good from here. Oh, yeah, I'm about as shocked as you are, Clark. Wow, that's a really smooth finish. That's why we and they always love seeing him at the end of those breaks. He makes it look Fun and easy. Screen by Cousins. So here's Westbrook. Back to Curry. Shot off the pick. And good. He nails it. Fourth quarter of play. We're about two and a half minutes through it right now. Feeds it to Irving. The dish to Drummond. Griffin with the steal. The shot by Hayward. Wide open. Rebound by John Wall. And here are the East All-Stars now. They trail by seven. George up top. Here's Irving. The shot off that time. Curry with the defensive effort. Westbrook dishes to Hayward. He feeds it to Cousins. Good D by Drummond. And George, here we go. And there's the whistle. Fouled hard on the shot. He'll go to the line. George having a fantastic game. Eight rebounds, and from long range, he's hit one three-pointer. And when it's all said and done, I got a sneaky suspicion he's going to have a few more. And he makes the first. You know, George has a pretty quiet way about him. He's not a very demonstrative guy, and I think that's appealing. He kind of lets the game come to him and lets his game do his talking. Carmelo Anthony has checked in for the East. Lowry comes in for John Wall. The West All-Star is also changing it up. Kawhi Leonard comes in for Blake Griffin. And Durant subbed in for Gordon Hayward. Now here's Westbrook. And the three off target. You know what? They're winning, though, despite the fact that he has just been really off. Good on that shot. And with that, the West All-Stars lead is cut down now to just four in the basket from Kyle Lowry. Westbrook kicks to Durant. The pass to Curry. A three ball. No good. So the East All-Stars will take it the other way. His touch has disappeared on him this quarter. He just hasn't been able to get it going. Here's George. It's rebounded by the West. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. The open shot, Durant. And that comes off the assist by Russell Westbrook. Westbrook's got his sixth assist on the night. 
James with it. Outside Irving. Off the screen. And a kind roll that time off the rim as it unfolds. Big time bucket there. And you can expect to see him stay very involved the rest of the way. Oh, I agree with you wholeheartedly there. I mean, this is one guy who just does not know how to back down. Especially when the game's on the line in crunch time. That could be costly. But when the game is hanging in the balance, the last thing you can afford is to turn it over. Lillard's checked in for Russell West. One thirty-seven left in the fourth quarter. Irving. Again, Irving missing. Well, I think the defense got lucky right there. I mean, he's going to make a lot more of those than he misses when he's got that much room. Here's Cousins. That one misses. Anthony with the defensive effort. He kicks to LeBron. Outside Irving. Great use of the pick to create room for the jumper. Irving's got four points in the quarter. Boy, you got to love that assist by LeBron. Here is Lillard. They set the pick. Left side, Leonard. Pulls up. That one a little long. George passes to Urban. Here's Anthony. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. Mello having a terrific game. He has 11 points, and they've got to be happy with his work on the glass, too. They really do. He is not giving up any ground in the paint, and when the ball goes up, you know he's going to be there to fight for it. He gets the first, and that narrows the gap to one. So much riding on. Now a timeout called by the West All Stars. Four seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Cousins. Buries it. Oh, the 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 shot of the game. Well, he was fearless enough to get it up and Art. down, and it paid off for him. And the East All Stars call time here. They're losing by two. There's 38 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. with the screen on Lillard. Nails it! A huge 20, shot to 20. tie it up. This is what happens when you allow Carmelo Anthony to heat up. Now a timeout called by the West All-Stars. <laughs> 29 seconds left in the fourth quarter. 
Curry kicks to Cousins. Outside Curry. From the arc. Buries it from outside. No question about it. Curry is on fire right now. Timeout called East all -Stars. They're behind by three. There's 14 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Guys, your thoughts? And there's still time left, so they don't necessarily have to go for the three. A quick, easy bucket inside will do. Well, I think the clock's a little short here for that. I mean, I'm not quite sold on the quick two. I think they've got to look for a quality three to try to tie this thing up based on where the clock is right now. And they commit an intentional foul. We'll see another one of those so they can get into the penalty. Yeah, you have to do that, though. You can't just let them dribble the game out. Exactly. I mean, got to stop the clock any way possible and hope they alligator arm a few of those free throws. And they go to the intentional foul. It's the first that gives them a four-point cushion. So he goes two for two at the lock, and it's a five-point game. And that's exactly how you close the game out. Those free throws will bury them for sure. And the East All-Stars call time here. They're trailing by five. Six seconds left in the fourth quarter. Guys, what's your take? And a quick bucket and a foul is really the only option at this point. And the important thing about the foul is who you foul. They don't want to send a top-notch free thrower to the line if they can avoid it. So it's the West All-Stars picking up the win. And it's impossible to know what's going to happen in these games. The talent on both sides is always so strong. But tonight, the West seemed a little more comfortable playing together as a unit. And that's what earned them the win. You mentioned that all broadcast long, and sure enough, it came to fruition. That brings us to the conclusion of our All-Star coverage. Thanks, everyone, for tuning in. For Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan wishing you all a very good night. The 2K Sports Post Game Show. Welcome back. Ernie Johnson with Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jet Smith in the All-Star Game action now in the books. So let's take a look back at some of the footage from our All-Star Game MVP, Stephen Curry. What more can you say about Steph Curry? The man has done it again tonight. He is the most electrifying shooter in the history of the game. I'm going to say it right now. In the history of the game, he is a leader and his will to win is unparalleled. Well, he had fun out there. He also didn't shy away from putting on that flash and pizzazz to make the highlights. I thought he gave the fans a gutsy performance. All the celebrities stopped looking at me and started waving at him. We had a couple of good candidates, but he deserved it. And that's going to do it for this year's All-Star Game. Oh, what a night it's been. Some splendid talent on display. Uh, and that doesn't even include Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jet Smith. Appreciate that. And our award-winning 2K Sports Group. For all of them, this is Ernie Johnson. We will see you again sooner than you'd like.